Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to set up the weekly and daily pages in my B6 Stalogy. To do that we are going to use this sticker kit from DEK Designs, the December subscription box which I got. Um, it comes in November but it's for December. So this is a Christmas holiday themed uh, sticker kit. We have two pages of full boxes, some headers and flags, some boxes, some to do today's, some glitter headers, checklist, weekend banner. I went through this in my previous video, so I'm just going to speed through it now. We have some deco, some checklist boxes, some date covers and washi tape, more date covers. Not sure which ones I'm going to use, but we have a lot to choose from. Some deco, some more boxes, and some more deco. I love the DEK Design subscription boxes because you get a lot with the sticker kit alone. So to me, that makes it worth it. The washi tape that came with it is this, these two washi tapes, but I'm not going to use them in this box. They do match the kit, but they're a little too pink for me. I wanted to emphasize the red and greens, the traditional Christmas colors, instead of the pink that's in the kit. So I pulled in some other washi tapes. We have these two from Simply Gilded. This washi tape I got from Hobby Lobby. And these I got from Michaels. So we are going to jump right in. Let's just do a quick flip of my December pages so far. We have the monthly December cover page. Then we have the monthly calendar and my monthly dashboard where I'm going to put my monthly to-dos and goals, things like that. So now we are going to set up the week of November 29th through December 5th. So to do that, I'm going to put my this week page on the left hand side and then we are going to do one page per day. So to do the monthly, not the monthly, the weekly this week page, I'm going to use the Simply Gilded washi tape. I have to turn this upside down to do it because these unroll in the opposite direction. So we're going to put this one right across the top. And we will use the bigger one at the bottom. And then we are going to get our colorful boxes sticker book by the Happy Planner and find a little box to write the header in at the top. And I believe we have some red. They're more pink than red, but yeah, those are a little too pink. I could do silver. Let's do silver, because this will match the bows. And I just eyeball it. I don't try to center it too much. So this is for the week of the 29th through the 5th. So let's write those dates in. November 29th to December 5th. And then we are going to use our kit to make our this week page useful. So the first thing I'm going to do is put, we do have a this week in here, so I will use that. Oh, I should have used the washi tape from the kit. 
That's what I should have done. I'll use that on one of the pages. Oh, the Monday through Sunday. Where's the Monday through Sunday? We have our habit trackers. The Monday through Sunday for our meals is here. So let's do this. Let's do meals. No, let's do this week first. And then we need a to-do list. So let's use this one. And then we are going to do our meals underneath. Or should I do the meals next to it? No, I'll do the meals underneath. With the Monday through Sunday. And then habit trackers. We will use these habit trackers. Should I start with the red or the, I'll start with the red. Pink and green. And then I haven't really been using my habit trackers, but I am still going to, I'm still going to write them down because last week I didn't do much of anything that was on my trackers and the week before, but I will still use these. And then underneath we can use a little bit of deco. Let's use this girl delivering her home cooked pie not delivering, presenting her home cooked pie. And then we have this little awkward space right here on the side. I will probably just put some washi tape or deco down there. At the bottom is where I'm going to put my next week. I will use, let's see. Let's use this washi tape right here, this green washi tape with candy canes on it. This washi tape right here, we are going to use this to divide the this week from the next week section. Like that and I don't have a next week sticker but let's see what kind of scripts we have we have to do today exercise work I'm going to look in my reusable sticker book and see if I have any stickers that I could use I have this one that says remember I could use that Yeah, we'll use this one. And we'll put it down there like that. So the only thing we have to do is worry about this space down here. And I have this other sticker book, the Peppermint stripe sticker book by recollections 
And I believe we have some kind of garland washi tape that might work. I think I'm gonna use this one right here, the one on the side. So we will put it starting here. and cut it there. And we'll continue it like that. So it looks like that when you see it from the side. Um, let's see. Let's put this one back on paper. And then we are going to go into Monday. So for Monday, we are going to use, I think we'll do this one at the bottom and this red one at the top. And so I'm going to kind of alternate the washi tape. I think I'm going to continue using the red one at the top and then I will just alternate the bottom between these two. Because if I use this one at the top, it looks a bit too busy. So I'm not gonna use that one. Oh, I also have these. I think I'm just going to alternate these. So let's continue putting this down. Okay, so now we have the washi tape on all of the pages. Now we have to choose which date covers we want to use. I am leaning toward the green ones because these are our options. We have the alternating pink, green, red, and then we have these and I'm leaning toward these first ones because they're more traditional Christmas colors. I forgot to use this washi tape again. Why do I keep doing that? I forgot to use it. Luckily I have enough to do multiple weeks so I will get to use this washi tape at some point but we are going to use these at the top here. Monday Tuesday. And I guess now is a good time for me to ask how you all are doing. I hope you had a good Thanksgiving if you are in the US. And if you are not, then I hope you had a good week. I had a good Thanksgiving. I spent it with Jason's family and then I went to my mom's house afterward and we had apple pie together it was nice and then I came home and I was so sleepy from all of the good food that I just took a nap on the couch um, nothing too exciting going on I'm still on Thanksgiving break I should be doing the homework right now because I have a group project that I have to do my part of and then I have um, some other assignments that I need to get done. But instead, I want to play in my planner. So that's what we are doing. Now we have to put our date dots on and I believe this is the 29th. Let's see. Yeah, today's the 28th, tomorrow is the 29th. 
And we are going to use these date dots that came with the kit. They are clear, they are silver on clear sticker paper. So we are going to stick them right in front. 30, and we have one. Yeah, my school semester will be over in two weeks. I am super excited about that. And then I get a month off of school before I have to go back for next semester. So that should be exciting. I'm hoping that means I will be able to get more YouTube videos out. We will see how that goes. But we have those. Oh, then let's put down our today stickers. Let's move down. I want to leave space at the top. Should I put down a header? No. Should I? No, I'll just leave space at the top. Today, and then I will put down Oh, it's on the same page. <laughs> these uh, three checklists because I put my top three priority items for each day. And then I will put a to-do sticker. Let's use red. And then I will use I thought these usually come with a checklist box, but they don't this time. So I have to figure out what I'm going to do for my to-do list. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do about that yet. The other option is I could use No, I can't. I was gonna say I could use my Zig clean color dot markers, but I don't have the right colors for this. The other option is, let's see, we have this seasonal sticker book by the Happy Planner, and we have some checklists in here, I believe. But there are stars. I don't really want stars. So that is a no. Let's see what we have in here. We have these. These might work. Yeah, I think I will just use these checklists. The colors aren't exactly the same. The reds and greens are a little bit different, but I think that'll be fine. It's really the only, the easiest option that we have. So we will put this one here. And then I think I'll do that for each page or should I just continue going through putting down the boxes? because we have to figure out if we're going to put them at the top or at the bottom on the right hand side. Last week I put them at the bottom. This week I might put them at the top. So let's see, we have this sheet of stickers and this sheet of stickers. 
My desk is getting messy. And I think I'm going to go with this sheet of stickers and we'll save those for next time. So I'm gonna use this cute little guy and his mug of hot cocoa. I feel like I should use something else at the top here. Maybe a glitter header. How many glitter headers do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, I think I'll just put it down without the glitter headers. Like that. It does leave an empty space, this weird space here at the top, but it does give me enough room to write my to-do list here. So I like that. And then I can journal either at the bottom here or on the side. So let's do the same thing. Let's put down our to do today sticker, I mean. And then what did I do? Oh, one of these checklists. Then a to do sticker. And then one of these checklists. And a full box. Let's go with this wreath. Now this one is tricky because even though there's a hump here, I still like to put it on the line so that it lines up with the line closest to the spine. so that it looks something like that, but it's lined up with the edge of the page. So yeah, we're gonna do that. Then Wednesday, we have a today. And I'm trying not to color block, so I'm picking alternating colors but I think I'm gonna run into trouble because I only have green and red of these checklists. So. And then to do. And then let's go with green. And then a full box. Let's go with the snow globe. That looks cute so far. I really like how this is turning out. And then Thursday and Friday, let's use the pink today. With the red checklist. Then to do with the green checklist and a full box, we can go with this mug.
like that. And then let's do the same thing. Let's use today. I only have green left. Let's do this instead. Nope, that's tearing the paper. Looks like we're color blocking this one. And then to do let's use this plaid and a full box we could use bring in a little more pink with this guy no you know what I'm gonna use the left hand side I know this is a double box here at the bottom, but I'm gonna use the left-hand side over here. Like that. And then I'll use the other half of it on Sunday. So I don't have any more of these checklists, so I'm going to use these checklists that we have here. They don't give me as much room to write, but that's okay. And then to do... red checklist and a full box. We're going to use this cute little guy. Like that. And then I'm losing my marbles. Let's see, uh, we have one more today. And the to-do is also pink. I didn't think this through. So it looks like we're color blocking a little bit on Sunday also. One of these. And then to do with, let's do the plaid and the last full box. So we will put this one here. like that. I had to switch to a voice over here because the noise in the background of my video was a little bit too loud. But at this point, I'm just putting down some quarter boxes at the bottom of each page to write in my dinners each day. Then there's a little bit of space in the middle at the top of the page. So I'm putting in some of the deco stickers to put there. I'm putting down some flowers, bows, some mistletoe, just anything that works in that space. On this page, I put down this Joy sticker and it went down crooked. So I tried to fix it, but it was tearing the page. So I just had to leave it. It's crooked, I know, but we just had to keep going. So then I put down a bow sticker on each of these pages. And then I wrote in my plans, but I skipped that part of the video because I thought that would be boring to watch me write in my plans. So this is the final flip through. We have the this week page, then Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. 
Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.